You think you're as good as last year? All the work you did this year, like commercials, you think that that's taken the drive and the hunger away, being that, you know, you went through a lot of fame and, you know, and all that, you think that sort of made you a little soft, a little powder puffish? Well, I've always considered myself a powder puff, but I consider myself a really strong powder puff. Can't you tell by looking at things in Russell? Rachel McLeish, who has been a dancer for most of her life. She's been involved in bodybuilding for now for about eight years and has been competing for three and a half. She has won every major title in women's bodybuilding. Not surprising. She was the U.S. champion in 1980, Miss Olympia in 1980 and 82, and the professional world champion in 1982. She's always been interested in fitness and bodybuilding as a natural adjunct. There's no slouch either. Look at her conditioning and her legs. Rachel McLeish, just fantastic. You've got a choice. You've got bones, you've got flesh, and that flesh can be muscles or fat. And muscles is what shapes your body. So much more satisfying is the view of this kind of woman breaking out of the housewife's role than the two prevalent images of the modern female. It's probably one of the most difficult things in the world to do, to build muscle as you're losing fat. It doesn't just happen overnight. I mean, one of the misconceptions is you're going to wake up one morning and say, oh my God, what have I done? It happens very, very slowly. There's no activity that's going to make a woman look like a man. Muscle is a part of bodybuilding. Only a it part, really but it's all is, the overall presentation. It's an art form. Presented in itself as the human body, that's what kind of silly. Yeah. You know, big muscles isn't everything that bodybuilding is about. Well, what is bodybuilding about? I always thought it was big muscles. Most people do because what they see on television is, um, you know, a woman or a man in peak contest form. They've got the direct overhead lighting, they've got the oil bodies, they've got tanned pins, and they've got the flex poses. And of course, they see and they're misled, thinking, well, that's all it is. But it's not. It's beauty, it's symmetry, it's proportion. It's the overall it's impression, isn't it? Exactly. And presentation.